is, is not this wonderful, esoteric, elusive, uh, God-like feature that only the special among us are, will ever taste. You know, it's something that truly exists in all of us. It's very simple. This is what I believe, and I'm willing to die for it. True with man. It is impossible to be a maverick or a true original if you're too well behaved and don't want to break the rules. You have to think outside the box. That's what I believe after all. What is the point of being on this earth if all you want to do is be liked by everyone and avoid trouble? The only way that I ever got any place was the breaking some of the rules. When I was 17, I read a quote that went something like, if you live each day as if it was your last, someday you'll most certainly be right. It made an impression on me. And since then, for the past 33 years, I have looked in the mirror every morning and asked myself, if today were the last day of my life, would I want to do what I am about to do today? Listen to this figure. College students now owe $950 billion in student loans, and that's more than the entire credit card debt in this country. Is it worth the amount of time and energy and debt we're in? Trending on today.com, if you hate your job, you're apparently not alone. So what percentage of people do you guys think say they are not happy at work? I'd say unhappy. 50 percent. 70. Bingo. 70 yeah. percent of people who are asked in this brand new study say they admitted they either hate their work or they feel completely uninspired on the job. The report from the folks at Gallup says... A recent Gallup report shows that 70 percent of Americans either hate their job or disengage from their work. Some say vacation time in America is unfair. I want the money, money in the cars, cars in the clothes I suppose I just wanna be, I just wanna be successful I just wanna be, I just wanna be successful I just wanna be, I just wanna be successful